Hello, I'm Sue Newham and uh, this is the first of my pictures for um, April's exhibition. It's um, Amazing Grace and it's based on the story of the lost sheep and it's uh, a sort of composition that I had in mind for quite a while. It uh, started um, in at the beginning of last year but I must admit I was a bit scared of, of how I was going to tackle it and so I, I delayed and put off but finally God prompted me and um, so I've painted this picture. The sheep is really entangled in the brambles and one of the things that really spoke to me that God really impressed on me was that the sheep could not rescue itself no matter how hard it, it tries and it obviously has tried because of the wool um, it, no matter how hard it tried it couldn't rescue itself it was dependent on a rescuer coming and the shepherd um, is clearly Jesus um, I've um, put scratches on his arms because of the brambles but I've also made an allusion to the, the nail um, scars from the cross too um, so this is a amazing grace This picture is the storm will pass, but God remains. Um, I've, during last year, particularly, I felt as if I was in a terrible storm. Um, the world was in a terrible storm. And this idea of clinging to the rock um, was, was really foremost in my mind. But the fact that through all the storms that we face, God is with us still. And you can see the detail here um, of the, the coming hope and also um, in that space is a, a very small cross. This is my final um, picture, Trinity. Um, I have painted a similar picture before. Um, it was in 2009, so quite a long time ago, and I really wanted to revisit that amazing relationship between Father, Son and Holy Spirit, um, three in one. And uh, I've used the primary colours and a symbol for the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Um, and in the original picture and now as well, I imagine that these primary colours, um, as they spin very fast, like on a spinning top, they make white um, in the middle. Um, to show that they're one as well as having separate identities. So I hope you like these pictures.